We have had partly cloudy skies throughout the day today, and outside of the wind, it's actually been a really nice day today in the Electric City. Temperatures right now are currently in the mid to upper 50s and low to mid 60s, so it does feel pretty nice outside. And the wind has been diminishing a little bit over the past few hours, but it's still breezy right now, especially around and west of I-15 with sustained wind speeds currently between 10 and 25 miles per hour. There have been scattered showers and a few thunderstorms around today, primarily in the northern half of the state and especially along central and east eastern portion of the high line. That's where we've had the most impactful precipitation. And that's all associated with a disturbance that's currently working its way eastward through Alberta and Saskatchewan. And that will continue to work its way eastward as we head into tonight. But then there is another disturbance currently impacting the Pacific Northwest right now. This will be working its way through Montana as we go through tomorrow. And tomorrow is going to be the wettest day of the holiday weekend. Scattered showers and a few thunderstorms will continue for the next few hours, but once the sun does set, most of our precipitation will taper off. We're also going to have decreasing clouds over the next few hours with increasing clouds during the second half of tonight. Tomorrow, we are going to have partly to mostly cloudy skies throughout the day. During the morning, there will be some showers and mountain snow in western Montana. East of the divide, a couple showers are possible. Most locations will be dry, but then there will be scattered showers and thunderstorms around tomorrow afternoon and evening throughout a good chunk of the state. Make sure you have that rain jacket handy and keep an eye to the sky if you are going to be outdoors at all later on tomorrow. As we head into tomorrow night, that precipitation will work its way into the eastern part of the state, but we may see some snow develop in the Rockies tomorrow night. And then on Sunday, we are going to have partly cloudy skies throughout the day. Most locations around and west of I-15 will be dry, but we'll continue to have a few showers around during the day on Sunday, especially along portions of the High Line as well as in the eastern half of the state. But overall, it will be drier on Sunday than it will be during the day tomorrow. The wind is going to diminish this evening, and then for tomorrow, a lot of locations will have little to no wind, but along and just east of the Rocky Mountain front, it is going to be a breezy day tomorrow, including in most of Glacier County as well as Tool County with sustained wind speeds between 10 and 20 miles per hour. We are then going to have increasing wind as we go through 